Okay, welcome. This is the energy vibration love reading for um, the month of June for the Cancer Sun Moon and Rising sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Whoa, what a day! It has been just so a bloody day. So you Cancers, okay. So this is the month of June. Let's see what is happening for you Cancers. And um, I want to wish you a really wonderful, powerful month for you cancers so let's see what is happening um so we're calling up on um the goddess of love um, venus to come in and show us the energy vibration for the cancer sun moon and rising sign so first we have control issues whatever the situation is there is control issues then we have the soulmate so some of you are dealing with control issues a true gem that is going to be coming in so ooh, this is good for you cancers then we have um, this was a spiritual awakening with the true gem so and it is also true love is coming in oh my god open relationships <laughs> you cancers oh my god oh my god you have dating and uh, um, there is a situation where some of you but it's a short-term relationship so some of you could be dating a young blonde it is a karmatic situation um, this is a past life situation and we have um, some mature men coming up now you guys are dealing with the ice um, prince now the ice prince is always uh, people in authorities sometimes they come up as people in authorities but not all the time which is kind of strange but sometimes they do come up with people in authorities so a lot of you are dealing with a past relationship and I'm seeing the situation where some of you are dealing with some control issues with soulmate they're really true gems but you got to be careful some of you mature men are having spiritual growth which is really good really positive now some of you are dealing um, or could be connecting with someone in, who is a lawyer doctor or someone who is in the legal field um, they're dealing with past life issues there's definitely an open relationship and it's a karmatic one I'm seeing dating I'm seeing that some of you are going to be going on dating with a blonde female but it's just short term um you young men came up so whatever the situation is whatever is transpiring you young men came up now um it's you young men between the ages of 18 and 45 that is dealing with a blonde um and you know this is a situation where whoever you are um you're dealing with someone who is um blonde red hair blue eyes that sort of a situation but it's going to be short term there's nothing that is going to last okay so um that's the situation that is happening it's it's, it's not going to be lasting um for you guys okay i've been guided to do something else but um so let's see we're going to be receiving some message about control issues some of you are dealing with control issues I'm seeing you're trying to find inner strength to deal with a situation okay then we have uh, the nine of cups some of you your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true because you're going to be meeting that twin flame or soulmate and um, you know the truth of a situation with this person so whatever that is transpiring with this person you know the truth of a situation with this person then we have a lot of party um, a lot of you are going to be connecting um, with people um, who you have known there is going to be, um, become a balance in your life a lot of party is going to be happening definitely a lot of party now the wheel of fortune comes in and when the wheel of fortune comes in in the love reading is that whoever you're dealing with there is the energy of spiritual growth that is coming up and whoever you're dealing with 
and some of you have a true love some of you really um, there is true love that is coming in for you and you have a strong foundation whoever this person is is really true love and this person means a lot to you and um, you mean a lot to this person it's really true love but there is just some situation that is out of balance so some of you could be connecting with someone in authority and that sort of a thing now I'm seeing some of you who have open relationship this open relationship that is here and what is transpiring is that a lot of you are trying to work on these open relationship definitely some of you are definitely going to be getting married which this energy shows so some of you could be getting going to weddings or definitely getting married I'm seeing a lot of you dating and whoever you're dating you're going to get married to okay I'm seeing a lot of protection um, some of you realize uh, a situation that is transpiring around you you're definitely going to be having a lot of protection um, your marriage whatever your marriage is and whatever is going on the seven of swords is here so someone tried to pull off something but it didn't work and it has to do with you young men whatever you try to pull off I think you're trying to get someone pregnant but it's not gonna work because this relationship is not going to last it is a short-term relationship some of you are going to be trying to work on the relationship but whoever you're in this relationship with is not really what they want okay they're going to be realizing who you are some of you men 45 years and older is definitely going through a karmatic situation um, you older men comes up with short-term relationship which you're connecting with people to clear karma okay so whenever the energy of karma comes up is that you're connecting with someone just to clear karma and that's it okay so you could be in love with the person the person could be in love with you but it's uh, a karmatic situation that needs to be clear you could have known this person in a past lifetime and whatever the situation is and whatever the situation was you're just um, to back together again to clear some karma this karma has something to do with kids some of you are turning your back on a past relationship and you're moving forward whoever um, out there is turning their back on this past relationship it's as if this relationship you don't need this relationship when you're deciding I am letting it go some of you men 45 years and over older there is going to be some heartbreaks let it go um, whatever is transpiring with this heartbreak you need to let it go let it go because it's not it, it doesn't work it trust me you're wasting your time to go through this energy of heartbreak some of you um, you're growing spiritually you're understanding things you're growing spiritually this is good because what is transpiring is that you're moving forward in your life and you're really understanding what life is all about what love is all about and this is profoundly um, positive for a lot of you because what is transpiring, which I really don't need my glasses I'm always wear my glasses um, what is transpiring is that the, the wheel of fortune the wheel of fortune and the chariot in a love reading is saying to you that spiritual growth is on the horizon where you're going to be understanding relationship more and understand that some people only come in your life for a short time some of you have a strong foundation there is true love that is coming in you have a very very strong foundation what I love about the readings for you cancers is that I'm seeing that some of you are going to be releasing yourself from a situation or from a person okay and it was a controlling situation where you're going to be releasing yourself from this person so whoever this person is whatever that is transpiring whatever is coming up is that this person has been very controlling whatever um, is going on they're very controlling now I'm seeing a lot of success coming out with people who are in open relationship because I think that people um, a lot of people want to change the energy vibration and change it to an open relationship and uh, 
um, success is going to be coming in so if you're in an open relationship I'm seeing that a lot of you are working on yourself but also working on the relationship in the meantime and this is very good because what is transpiring is that people are more understanding themselves as they are in open relationship when people are in open relationship they understand that you know this relationship if I want this relationship to happen for me I definitely have to work on it and then maybe the energy will change and the person will choose for you or you will choose for the person so I'm seeing a lot of open relationship is coming up and I'm seeing success is going to be coming with these open relationship now the day 10 a lot of people are day 10 and I think that some of you are definitely looking for marriage a lot of you are definitely looking for marriage whatever that situation is and whatever that is transpiring it's that the, the, the dating scenes for you guys is kind of like over okay it's really kind of like over and you guys are looking for someone to settle down and marry to I'm wishing you guys a lot of luck there's no way <laughs> I know so some of you are going to be connecting with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn this is someone from a past lifetime I'm seeing the more mature men going for this person and I'm seeing um, good luck coming in so if you are looking for your twin flame or soulmate it's by a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn they say that you guys match with a Capricorn but I really don't think so and maybe because I'm a Capricorn cops I don't really match with a full cancer I just think that it's kind of off I just think that cancer is the only thing that match the Capricorn and the cancers is that you know their parents is the most important thing and like their mom but for the rest of it I think that because I'm a cat person because I'm really thinking about to rewrite the book about relationship and the people who connect especially when you're looking for your soulmate and twin flame because I am not seeing that energy vibration with a Capricorn and a cancer um, there is not a lot of Capricorn and cancer relationship I'm definitely seeing a new love coming in um, for a whole lot of you and this new love is going to be a true gem okay so whoever this new love is coming in this new love is going to be a true gem this new love is going to be there um, to last a lifetime and this is going to be good so it could be another Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person but this true love is coming in I'm seeing you guys really going out having fun this is someone who you have known for quite some time. So this person comes with all the qualities that you have been looking for and this is just going to be nice so the burdens is over and whatever that was transpiring I'm seeing that this burden is over because um, some of you men were in some short-term relationship and the burden is coming to an end because as if uh, you felt as if this relationship was outcast was off balance so there is definitely news coming in news from someone who is coming in and I think you guys are just going to cut the person off and I think that is better some of you realize that you could not trust this person and you have let it go okay so whatever the news that is coming in is as if I really don't want to hear about you anymore um, you know there's nothing that you have to say that I need to listen to because basically I think we have said everything so definitely you're going to be like telling this person or telling someone hey it is good I don't need because you realize that this person come to you only for information whatever information they were looking for um, and you know some of you and this is just so funny because uh, um, what I'm picking up is that there is some one of you out there that um, you were seeing someone and this person this person is so off balance so off cast and um, you realize this and the person wanted like to do something um, either get you pregnant to, to hold you fast to hold you um, but this person whatever they were trying to do and whatever information it didn't happen 
I'm seeing a lot of conflicts that is coming up with this person because whatever information this person was supposed to get they're not getting the information it's as if they're not capable enough to get out certain information from someone and the person actually realized so you could be in a relationship where you know there was some control issues but yeah it's still you're kind of releasing yourself from it but um, some of you it could be affecting the mature men that um, you realize that there was someone younger that you were in a relationship with and it's as if this person wants a lot of information from you and you're just not trusting this person so you're just like giving them whatever you think that they want and um, they want and that's it some of you are seeing the truth with a situation because you're fine you're, you're realizing that someone came in your life but not for the right reasons as as if this person wanted to get you pregnant and to hold on to you because I'm seeing kids but there's a lot of conflicts because you decided this is not what I want so this person has moved on to um, a younger version but they're going to be finding out to how this person is and cut them also off because they are someone that is stable and they realize that this person is a little bit off so they are going to be not working on the relationship but cut this person off I'm seeing that some of you are learning to love yourself and understand um, what is transpiring because you decide to cut out you know these actions of people that no longer serves you and some of you could be dealing definitely with um, definitely with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion now your intuition about this person was right okay so you young men or women that is dating someone your intuition about this person is right you're right on target with this person okay this person is dating all over the place they're seeing a lot of people let it be because this person think that you know they're so smart and so good and they know and they're on top of their games and you are just definitely playing the games that they want to play with you so I'm seeing this person later on is going to just lose it like in the month of July and they're going to be coming back to you and saying hey you know I'm sorry for what has transpired and um, I'm really sorry and I you know I'm hoping that there is still hope for you and them and you're going to say no you're definitely going to say no and this could affect the people 45 years and older you're definitely going to say no this person was not honest whatever that was going on this person is not honest to themselves so they can't be honest to other people so that is what happened and you know for a lot of you older men who were in young relationships I'm seeing you having a lot of conflicts because it's as if there is someone that you want to give a chance in your life but this person is just all over the place and you're leaving them because you know you can't push people to do what they don't want to do now the energy of uh, um, the um, the energy of this um, um, lady 45 years and older you could have de be dealing with uh, some control issues and it's you know it's as if things are going to be changing because you're going to be realizing that you know I, I can't control what I can't change and this is going to be good I'm seeing the Knight of Wands that is coming up, and the energy of the Knight of Wands is that someone, this Knight of Wands, could send someone to find out something. Now, this person, whoever the person is, it's not really sensible because the person is saying, Hey, I'm not here for this and I'm not here for that. But then um, it could be that some of you are divorcing an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius or an older person and I'm seeing that there is conflicts because um, you ladies are divorcing this person and want to get rid of this person but what is transpiring is that this person is sending out people to find there's huge conflicts because um, whatever this person has done you're seeing the truth about the situation and you have gotten deep in the situation you are going to be having some victory and success coming up for you you have a strong foundation so a lot of you that is connecting um, 
there is definitely a strong foundation and victory and success is definitely going to be coming true so, you know a lot of relationships especially um, if you are in an open relationship you're going to be finding out that this person is the deal you know this person is the person a true love someone who is honest and supportive to you and you're going to be keeping that relationship I'm seeing someone coming back to you for a new start but you're going to say no it's as if that spiritual energy whatever that you have connected and with this person that energy is over and you're saying goodbye and you're leaving it now there's definitely some positive energies that is coming in because new love is coming in this person you're going to be getting engaged to so wonderful positive energies um, because um, some of you um, have been seeing this person for quite some time and definitely you're going to get engaged to this person because you're going to be realizing that there is nothing better outside there um, the energy of the family is in reverse and it has to do with uh, um, the women your family is in reverse because there is so much conflicts it's as if there is so much conflicts and this conflict is caused by the night uh, a Taurus Bur uh, no an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius this month is uh, uh, 45 years and older and they are so in the reverse now there is an energy for some of you um, who are looking for your twin flame or your soulmate you're going to be finding it within the Taurus Virgo or Capricorns there is definitely a lot of conflicts a lot of conflicts over pregnancy a lot of conflicts some of you are seeing the truth why an older person got you pregnant for whatever the reason is there is definitely conflicts I'm seeing the energy for the younger people where some of you are learning to love yourself some of you start to understand yourself in a relationship and whatever that is transpiring around you you're starting to understand yourself and you're going to be okay you're definitely going to be okay now some of you are connecting with this beautiful lady she's a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person you're connecting with this person this is the true gem a lot of you are going to be asking this person the ends in marriage and you're going to be going forward <coughs> sorry I'm going so fast you guys are going to definitely so I'm seeing good news coming in here and a strong foundation I don't know who this is for but there is someone out there who has let go of a negative energy okay you know that this person was just full of BS and they tried to play some games with you and you play back the game what they came in to play and this is just good because there is just someone that some of you have opened up your lives to and trying to see the beauty within this person but this person has been playing you guys and what you're going to do is that you have start to play back the game because this person just is a very smug and think that they are so on top of their games and you realize that they were playing a game so you play the game back and um, they're not really liking this game but you know this is the energy and the situation is that there is so much conflicts because it's as if some of you um, someone wanted to get some of, of, of some of you pregnant and the thing about it is that they were doing it because they were told to do it and now they want proof and now you are saying you know sure you can have that proof but you know the thing about it is that you know that this person is playing a game basically and you are on top of the game also because it's as if this person just take um, whatever the situation is because from the beginning with certain things and certain action you realize that this person wasn't being honest now this person is so smug because they're 
basically seeing other people and then they're lying and when you catch them at the lies then they start saying other things so you basically let them because there is definitely a deception play here there is definitely a deception um, you know this person it's as if this person is in and out in and out in and out and you realize that this person has been very honest you feel it with the energy vibration of this person and yet still you play around with this person because you think you know something if you are playing a game I can even play a bigger game and I know when I play my game I'm good because you know you you are on top of your game you can search are very highly sensitive you feel um, when things are array and this is what I say to other people the heart sign people and the water sign people they're always on top of their game so you know it's the last person you should try and fool and it's the earth sign and the water sign now there are some heart sign that is trying to mess up you guys and it's as if you're like listen maybe in the past you could have gotten away with this but it's not happening because I'm seeing that some of you ladies realize the play that has been played and you start taking precaution because you realize that this person was in to get you pregnant and you took precaution because you were on top of the game you realize that someone um, send this person now whoever this person is you know the truth about them because they were just looking for um, friends with benefits and you kind of realize this and you know you you young people are really on top of your games because you saw this uh, deception move coming in and uh, um, you just go along with it and you just play along with it you ladies um, are having some issues some family issues heartbreaks is coming up um, there is um, you, you ladies are sending out someone to get some information it's as if you have a family member and you're losing something so you're sending out this family member to connect with another person but this person knows exactly what you're doing and they're smart so they just keep the game flowing so I'm seeing um, you ladies 45 years and older that um, you know a situation is not working in your a, a favor in the sense that um, you're trying to get rid of um, 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 Aries Leo or Sagittarius it, uh, this person has created so many havoc and a situation in your life and you know you are looking at the whole play and you're thinking oh my god how do because this 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 is this is someone else that you have opened up your life to is coming in and trying to play these games and you're thinking do you think that I'm so stupid that I'm not seeing between the lines what is transpiring because you're all ups you're all ups you meditate you see it you know what is coming so then you can play your game good um there are um, some of you with kids I'm seeing a lot of conflicts with relationship because it's as if um, I'm seeing twins coming up whatever the situation is I'm seeing twins coming up but it is a situation where some of you ladies are going to be thinking hey I see what exactly is transpiring and it's not happening I'm seeing some of you got pregnant and it's not going to say anything to your partner you are just going to be moving on and dealing with the issue and I think that you know you're right um, however way you think about it and I I see you really just mm, it's the word I no, I will never say anything to this person you know let them let them be sometimes you have the inkling but what you have done is block the person from your phone and you think I will resolve the situation I am happy I'm moving forward I no longer want you in my life because you came in being so deceptive and you know you know that the person was playing I'm seeing other people who had the similar um, situation is that 
they went and they got precaution they're like you know come with all your bullshit and, I, and I'm seeing some of you are definitely going to just flush your system flush your body and release and that is the best thing to do like whenever you're in these really not really horrible um, relationship some of you has gone under your belt and um, I'm seeing some of you decided I'm going to just clear my system of this person and release myself of this energy and I'm seeing the same person coming back and they're going to apologize to you and ask you if they're because the thing about it is that they were very smug and they were very smug because they know they were seeing someone else and they thought you weren't um, knowing this and you are like you know seriously and you block the person but then sometimes you think you know am, am I being so hush and then you let the black up and now you're deciding hey I'm flushing my system as if I never know you and that sort of a thing and you know I am not here to judge you I think you're doing the right thing if you're having the child I think you're doing the right thing if you're not having the child I think you're doing the right thing because it's your decision it's not my decision it's not what I'm here to tell you I am here to tell you whatever decision you made whether or not you will keep um, the child I'm seeing someone here that as twins they're going to be keeping their twins because I think they've been always um, trying to get pregnant and then they never could get pregnant so they are going to keep it and people always say you know like when I give a love reading and these things come up people always say what is your advice to, to me my advice is that listen to your own intuition okay um, you know depends on if you are in a situation and a relationship that someone treats you like nasty I don't see how the child is going to be coming in maybe you get this beautiful child you never know but maybe you get an, a child who is an asshole like that one do you want to let a child treat another woman or treat someone like that and that's it sometimes men are not seeing who they are men have this ego and there are some of you that was dealing with someone that has an ego as huge as what and you decided hey I'm gonna set you to rest I no longer want to deal with you and I'm seeing the women taking responsibility of what they have done and they're changing the old energy vibration and you know if you are in the age of 40 and you're alone and this person is not compatible with you and whatever the decision you make it is it is your decision so you know this is perfect this is absolutely perfect what is happening I'm seeing a lot of you in your marriage is not trusting a situation some of you have a feelings that your partner has their eyes on someone else and you know I always say to someone if that's how you're feeling ask your angels and guides to show you and let you see it sometimes it is painful because they will show you and they will let you see it but at least you know where you stand and that sort of a thing I'm seeing good strong foundation I'm seeing people who are in open relationships are really working on their relationships some of them are going to realize that the person they're in an open relationship is the true love of their lives and this is going to be good I'm seeing a lot of you really having some fun time with a Virgo and this Virgo is a true gem go for this relationship because it's really really going to be satisfying um, this is wonderful because I'm seeing like the more mature people coming up in the relationship especially um, for the Capricorns there is definitely some conflicts over a pregnancy so I'm seeing some of you who are pregnant there is a conflict over the pregnancy you're seeing the truth of the situation um, whatever is transpiring you're going to be working this out all by yourself because I'm seeing the Empress is going to be keeping her children because she's having twins and this is if you know I'm cutting out uh, this negative energy of this person and I'm keeping my child and this is going to be good wonderful love um, uh, relationships 
um, you guys are going to be picking up with the Taurus Virgo or the Capricorn I'm seeing your wishes and dreams coming true because some of you are going to be finding your twin flame in a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn I'm seeing also um, this beautiful lady that is coming in and she is coming in very strong because she's coming in with a gem so a, a lot of you whoever this person is she's coming in and she's coming in from a good place and it's going to be okay so um, you know share these reading um, go check out the rest of the reading go check out your partner's reading um, for single it is a good 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 if you're single and looking for someone to mingle I'm seeing the Taurus Virgo and Capricorn ladies coming in where which is going to be good I'm seeing definitely a new start you're moving forward uh, I'm seeing a lot of you connecting with um, you know people who are from honesty um, as we look at this side it is a lot of conflicts especially with marriage some of you are not trusting your partner in marriage and you're thinking about it because you kind of figure out that there is something that isn't right and you are right on target because this is definitely going to be coming out ladies and gentlemen I want to say to you have a wonderful month namaste until next time